Hi everyone, Fatma here from Addictive Tips and I'm going to show you how you can lock down the desktop background on Windows 10. Before you get started, you should first find the wallpaper that you want to set permanently as your desktop wallpaper and save it somewhere that you know it's not going to be deleted. It's a good idea to save this image to the root of the C drive because ordinary users that do not have admin rights will not be able to delete it from there. So now we have to edit the Windows registry. Use the Win plus R keyboard shortcut to open the run box and in the run box you want to type regedit. Tap enter and it's going to open the registry editor. Once you have the registry editor open, you want to go to this location on your screen. Right click the policies key and from the context menu select new key. Name this key system. Now right click the system key and select new string. Name the string value wallpaper. Double click it and in the value data box you want to enter the complete path to the wallpaper that you want to set as a default. Next you want to right click the system key again and select new string. This time you have to name the string value wallpaper style. Now wallpaper styles are how a wallpaper is applied to your desktop. It can be centered, it can be tiled, it can be stretched, it can fit your screen or it can fill your entire screen. I'm going to go with fill here. So I'm going to enter four. Now, once you've done that, what you have to do is you have to restart File Explorer. To restart File Explorer, open the Task Manager and on the Processes tab, you want to look for Windows Explorer. Select it and then click the Restart button at the bottom. Once File Explorer restarts, you're going to have your new desktop background. And when you open the Settings app and go to the Personalization group of Settings and then select Background, you're going to see that you are no longer able to change the desktop background. To reverse this, all you have to do is delete the system key and that's automatically going to delete all the string values that you created under it. Restart File Explorer and you'll be able to change the desktop background again. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later with more tech tips.